So here's a question. What is slope? What does it mean to have positive slope? What does it mean to have negative slope? What if I have zero slope? What if the slope doesn't exist? We're going to talk about all four cases and we're going to do it by graphing it. Now slope is used in a lot of different equations, but what we're going to use is a slope intercept form, which is y is equal to mx plus b. So if you ever see this equation, just know that it's called the slope intercept form. Now, why do we call it that? We call it the slope intercept form because if it's if you have that equation, you could easily find the slope and easily find the y-intercept. The m is your slope right there. And your b is your y-intercept. So when you have that equation, m is your slope, b is your y-intercept. Now. I'm going to put in an equation in. We're going to use positive slope. Let me put, let me do this. Okay. We have y is equal to, let's say 3x, uh, let's go plus 4. I have a red line. For y is equal to 3x plus 4, what is my slope? What's my slope for y is equal to 3x plus 4? My slope is equal to 3. And my y-intercept, that's the b value. See, the slope was 3. Slope is always the number in front of the x. And the y-intercept is the number that you're going to add or subtract. And so we're adding 4, positive 4. What the y-intercept means, remember, is where it crosses the y-axis. So the line crosses the y-axis at 4, right there. So we have that. And what does the slope of 3 mean? I know that this is a positive slope. If the line goes up, left to right okay if you look at the graph and you move from the left of the graph to the right if the line is going up like what you have here it's a positive slope we think it's going to happen if I put a negative 3 in there y is equal to negative 3x plus 4 what happens to the line instead of going up left to right it does what it goes down left to right so negative slope just goes down left to right. Okay. So we know a positive slope goes up, negative slope goes down. What if I have zero slope? Hmm. How would I write zero slope? Y is equal to 0x plus 4. What happened? If you have zero slope, it's a horizontal line right here. If it's zero slope, you have that horizontal line. It's pretty easy. Now, I could also wrote this. Let me do this. I could also, zero times x is just zero, right? So I could also just say y is equal to four, and you'll see it's the same line. So, positive slope, it goes up, going left to right on the graph. Negative slope, it goes down, going left to right on the graph. If it's a zero slope, it's a horizontal line. So what do you think no slope is? These are both the same equation right here. Y is equal to zero x plus four and y is equal to four. What happens if we have a vertical line. We talked about the line that goes up left to right, line that goes down left to right, a line that is horizontal left to right, 
well how about a vertical line a vertical line is when you'll have something like x is equal to 2 that's a vertical line I'm going to get rid of these other ones and we're just going to look at when the slope doesn't exist A vertical line is you don't have a slope. If the line goes up from left to right, it's a positive slope. If the line goes down, left to right, it's a negative slope. If the slope is equal to zero, which same as just saying y is equal to 4, then what do we have? It's a horizontal line. And if the slope doesn't exist, you have a vertical line going straight up and down. I hope that helps.